All right, it's springtime, and I need a weed sprayer. So I got two DeWalt, uh, and a quarter-inch drive, and a drill, and I have a DeWalt uh, deal I got from Ace Hardware. So those are DeWalt batteries, and I had been using, and this is great, an old container for weed killer. Craftsman uses four AA batteries. This thing works pretty good. Shoots it out about 15 feet. It's got a plastic nozzle on it, but that's okay. Uh, worked for a couple years, and then I thought I would go to Harbor Freight. These things are 50 bucks, and it's a one gallon sprayer. Uh, one neat cool thing about it is the measuring cup is on the lid, which is kind of cool. So you can figure that out. But I wanted to use the DeWalt batteries, and so the DeWalt batteries basically has uh, 12 volts across these two pins and a couple other pins for charging the different batteries. But they won't fit directly into the Harbor Freight uh, weed sprayer unless you go in here and you see I basically took a pair of wire cutters and I cut out uh, the corners, that one and that one. So then this would slide, the, let, slide let the battery slide all the way in. Then I took it all the way apart. There's an off and on switch underneath here. Took it all the way apart. That still didn't work. So uh, what I did was I ran the on the terminals on there. There's a little circuit card on the bottom of that where it slides onto here. I basically took the 12 volts across there, ran it to the switch, and ran it straight to the pump. And there's an, actually a high pressure shutoff switch, so the pump doesn't run unless you're relieving pressure into the hose out to the end of a sprayer. Uh, so I bypassed that. Works perfectly fine. And so the only time that it actually runs is when you're applying pressure so let's see if I can line this up so everybody can see it so you take the DeWalt battery and you basically slide it into there and there's a tiny tiny gap but basically the battery is up against that that makes seats so you turn it on it'll pressurize the hose and one nice thing about the Harbor Freight one is this will allow this tube to slide in so you can have a little short sprayer uh, and in the end you turn this whether you want to have a stream or you want to have a spray So right now I've got it set up for a spray. So when I'm walking around I can spray my dandelions Do it that way and then If you turn this all the way out You can see exactly how far it'll spray which is about 10 feet so Works pretty good and Like I said the only time it runs is when you are pushing the little trigger on there so that's it, 50 bucks, use the DeWalt batteries that I already have, and it works like a champ.